Well, hello everyone and welcome back to Kingdom Come Deliverance. So we are here in Talmberg. Uh, here we go. <laughs> There's a map. Of, uh, look, I do like how close you can get to these maps and how they change. They kind of change their look and style. You zoom in. Look at that. It, it turns into like it's a it's an individual map segment, but you zoom out and it's kind of a, I don't know. I think they've done a really nice job with this game in general. All right. So we're going to, I think, well, I think maybe we'll take pebbles with us, but uh, let's take a look at our condition. Uh, we've got a bunch of food on us, but it's all, it looks like it's all going bad. Um, What do I want to do? I have a bit of dried meat. You know what? Hey, 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 hey. Uh, Good fella. We're going to get you up to Talib. He's a good boy. He's a good boy. That's my boy. Yeah, that's your boy. And then we're going to give him a bit of food. Look what I've got for you. Uh, people say, you know, you got to feed this. your dog. I actually feed it my dog all the time. <laughs> At least. <laughs> uh, anyways, we'll just give him a bit of uh, more, a little more of the dried meat. And I'm going to, I will be uh, looking for some more food for him. There we go. He's having a snack. Uh, in the meantime, I also need some nourishment. I am at 58. So I believe, if I remember correctly, is it through here? I think there's like a... Oh, everybody's asleep, but I might be able to... Uh, nope. Oh, I can eat from the pot. There we go. Perfect. All right. And now my nourishment is uh, 83 is fine. 83 is fine. I'm going to let them sleep because I don't really want to, you know, wake anybody up. So we're just going to close that door. All right. So we're in Talmberg. I do have uh, the ability to start a quest for Lady Stephanie. Uh, if we take a look at our journal, uh, I have my main quest, which is the Mysterious Ways. I have to go to, to uh, Ujits and uh, track down that fellow with the limp. But we're going to, we've got, I think we've got a little bit of time. This is the first time in quite some while that I've actually been able to just stop and do my own thing for a bit. Because it's always been, now you have to meet someone here and go. And they'd leave without me kind of thing, right? But up and but now I think I've got a bit of time. So I'm going to do some stuff. There's at your service, milady. So uh, she wants an unforgettable wedding gift for her cousin, Sophie. Uh, I found out that Lady Stephanie of Talmberg wants to talk to me. I should keep, shouldn't keep her waiting. I think I am going to keep her waiting because I don't want to just leap into yet another one. Now, I, I'm hoping that it's okay. When I ask like for advice on some of this stuff, it, more uh, often what I'm asking is like maybe the mechanics and stuff. You know, can I leave this quest? Is there going to be like any, is there going to be any downside to it? Is it going to hurt me in the long run? Um, and you know, you, you guys have been really good about, uh, you all have been good about giving me these, uh, like sort of, uh, not really hints, but just sort of ideas without telling me what to do. And I really appreciate that. All right. Now, um, just so I don't get uh, confused, I am actually going to, well, I don't want to do drop these in the middle of uh, Talmberg castle. These guys are nice people. I don't want to do, I don't want to. You know, like do anything bad, but we've got a number of item items on us. Oh, wait a minute! <gasps> oh, this I think. Oh, hey there, hi bud. I think so. I have I have a, a oh that's a close that's the closed off section. But I think I can actually I can get in here. And do I have a chest in here? No, I thought I'd have a chest in here, but I guess I don't. So it's not that kind of lodging. <laughs> there are some, there's like some of the rooms that you can rent. I think you can get access to a, like a global logistics storage chest that allows you to just sort of dump stuff in there and then you can access it from any one of your kind of sleeping spots. We're not going to, we're not going to, okay, we don't have access to that here. That's fine. That's fine. Um, so, but what I want to do today, we're not going to be uh, talking with Lady, uh, uh, Lady Stephanie. We are going to do something that I have been waiting to do, and that's take care of, as I say, my own business. So we're going to go down into Talmberg proper, and we're going to actually go and take a look at a few things. So let's grab our uh, little horse our horse here. Pebbles, Pebbles is, is super awesome. We're going to try not to run over this guard. He's probably going to get... Oh, no, he didn't complain. Okay, good. We're, we're going to cruise on down. So today's not going to be very action-packed. We're not. I'm going to try... We're not going to do quests and stuff like that. I'm more interested in... Oh, wait a minute. There was a traitor here, wasn't there? I think there is a traitor here. Let's... Let's... Uh, nope. 
No, that's not what I wanted to do. Oh my goodness. I keep on telling my dog to heal. There's a trader over here. There he is. Let's let's see what he's got. God be with you. Okay. <laughs> trade. trade. Let's take a look. If you've got the coin. I have some. Oh, well. Uh, how much coin do I have? 530 Groshen. Yeah, we're not doing too bad. Now, um, the first thing is, let's see what I can sell. Uh, you know, I could sell these apples, but it's like 0.1. I'm not going to bother. He's going to think I'm weird for selling him rotten apples. Um, boar hide, 15.1. Now, what am I doing right now? I want to see with this trader, like the a sample price. For example, this boar hide is 15.1 Groshen, right? And I understand that Oh, my charisma is at five. I need, you know what? We've got some important business. 15.1 for the boar hide. I'm going to have to remember that. But I think there's like um, a lot more to it than just, you know, everybody charges the same or gives the same prices for things. Is this the same dude from before? Hang on a minute. It is! <laughs> it's card redeem! <laughs> He's like, hey. He doesn't, he doesn't, he's, he doesn't want to talk to me though. Oh man. All right. Let's go down into Talmberg proper and, uh, take, did you just pee on their door? But seriously, bro, that is, oh, these are friends of ours. Why would you do that? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. All right. So we're going to head on down into Talmberg and I think, is there, I'm hoping let's, let's explore Talmberg, the, the town, the village. Uh, I'm hoping that they have a bathhouse. Now, I, I understand that there are numerous services that you can get at the bathhouse. But I can tell you that Henry is not that kind of guy. Uh, okay, let's take... Let's let's um, you know, let's get off here and then let's take a look. Now, what is this? Is it... Do we have any uh, indication on the map? It doesn't... Okay, unexplored place. All right, let's go down and explore. Baths! Oh, this is the bathhouse. Perfect. Oh, look at that. There's actual... Oh, this is kind of cool. Like, there's, like, outdoor bathy th things. Kind of like, uh, I can't remember what they call them. But that's that's neat. And I guess I could bathe in a uh, in a tub like this. Because, you know, that's, that's how I roll sometimes. But I would prefer to... Is there, like, a... Is this, like, an actual bathhouse where I can... I can deal with somebody? Oh, hey. Oh, oh, oh. Let's see. Who's this? Who's this? A villager. Okay, we can't talk to that villager. I wonder if we can't actually... Is this a proper bathhouse or is this... All right, well, let's... I'll tell you what. Let's go fill out some of the rest of the map and give people an opportunity to to wake up. You know, should we take the horse? Yeah, let's take the horse. I don't want to abandon pebbles. I just I, I just thought maybe we could cruise around on foot a bit. But Hey, soldier, how you doing? Okay, let's see what we got here. This looks kind of like a private residence, so... Let's just keep going. What's up here? Uh, one of the things that I want to find is a grindstone. Okay, this one's not giving me anything, any indication of what it is. Okay. <laughs> Doo -doo -doo. I assure you, sir, I am not up to no good. You do not need to follow me around. But I am going to just wander around. What is that? What is that? There's something on the ground here. It's a broken... I think it's a broken pot? I'm not actually sure. Oh, I think I... Is... Oh. <laughs> I'm not sure what he was doing. <laughs> yeah. uh, oh, I have stolen goods in my, uh, in my horse. I should be careful. I don't know if they can search my horse. I think someone hinted that that might be a thing... Lodgings! Oh. Oh. Actually, you know what? Here, let's hop off here. Because I can get a, a room for a day. And... Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay. Um, That's Marta. What do we have here? That's an alehouse maid. Oh, that's like what Bianca was. Oh, but it's not Bianca. Oh, oh no, sad. Um... 
Is this the actual... Oh, I think so. This is a... Uh, let's see. Oh. The door opened all on its own. Am I in... Private area. Private area. No. Okay. <laughs> I don't want to get in trouble. Innkeeper. 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 <laughs> is there a different entrance? What is this? That looks like a private area too. What is this place? I can't hear them. Hang on, let's... Can I... Oh, no, that's... Did it say... Lockpick, no. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, now who's this? This is a... That's Marta again. What do you think you're doing? You've no business here. It, this is supposed to be looking in... for someone? Yes, I'm looking for the innkeeper. My goodness. What is going on here? Your alehouse maid. How am I supposed to... Oh, my goodness. This is a very strange inn when I can't even go in the front door. What kind of place is this? Okay, let's let's look around outside. Maybe there's more... Uh... Yeah, I have no idea. <laughs> it's very weird. Is it because it's early again, or what's what's the scoop here? There's no inside to this this business. It's all outdoors. Because this door is closed. It's lockpick. Yeah. See, you can't. But this is open. But this is all lockpick stuff. <sighs> What's down here? <laughs> I'm very, I am I am very confused. Although I do like this little town. It's kind of cool. <gasps> pig! Do you see that? There's a pig over there. <laughs> cool. Oh, uh, fishing spot. Oh, you mean I can go fishing? <gasps> oh, they've got like the old old, old style, like uh, fishing sort of uh, traps, fish traps. And this looks like a compost of some sort. Okay. Well, let's just keep looking around and we'll we'll maybe come back a little later to check out some of the other stuff. Okay, I think I'm actually leaving the town now. Let's head back in and come back over here. And is there... Oh, I did leave my horse up here. All right, let's... <laughs> All right, innkeeper? No, alehouse maid. You know, if you guys aren't interested in, in, uh, in people's patronage... Uh, then you should not have a tavern. Let me take a make. Let me make sure. Is this? It says it's lodgings. Well, I beg to differ. <laughs> uh, there's a star. Where's the star? I think he's inside. Okay. Well, and I can't talk to Marta either. Hello. <laughs> All right. You know what? I don't I'm not interested. I'll come back later. We'll deal with things. What I was what I was thinking is if I got a room at least for a day, that would give me an opportunity to transfer crap out of my horse that's stolen into my the chest. <gasps> there he is. There he is. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh, dude. Dude. Okay. I'll be with you. <laughs> well, <laughs> I guess he was uh, off hours. Um what's happening around here? How are the Talmberg folk getting on? Is it peaceful here? Do you even have to ask? You're that lad from Scallies, ain't you? Yeah. It is you, ain't it? Well, you ought to ask folk in Rovna how they're doing. I know how Some they're doing. Some of them come here for an ale now and again, and they don't look too happy. I Let can... me think now. I imagine so. <laughs> I heard from the stonemasons there's been some trouble at the quarry. Oh. If it doesn't drive them away, they spend a lot here. Thirsty work, you know. I just hope Sir Divish and his quarry master get it sorted out. I'm going to guess that there's something there. Uh, oh, he has stuff to trade? Oh, he's got bacon, beer. Oh, I could buy bacon. You know what? I might actually do that because that's, um, well, actually, hang on. Um, he sells food. The reason why I'm looking at bacon is because, uh, look at the price. Is there anything cheaper that's preserved? Cooked pork. Like the, the dried meat was really good. Roast duck. Oh, wow. Uh, all right, I'm going to get a bit of bacon. In fact, I'm going to add, let's see, I'm just going to get, like, um, three of them. And that's for my dog, by the way. And maybe me, too. I mean, that's fine. And the re it is all really food. They have Save Your Snaps. Wow, it costs 134 
Moonshine? Seriously? Isn't that supposed to be Slivovitz? <laughs> I believe that the plum plum wine of the re uh, plum uh, uh, spirit of the region is Slivovitz. It's a uh, plum based stuff. Okay. Uh, and I know this because I've had some. Uh, all right. I think, yeah, I think that's good. So we're going to go to the basket and then we're going to close the deal. All right. Now, I want to talk to him about, I um, just want to. What's a, how much does a place to sleep cost? Have you got a bed for the night? Well, I suppose I could find something. For how long? Uh, just a night. Just the one night? Sure. I'll Let's show you why. First, these harsh times. Okay. How much? Two. Two Groshen. All right. I can do that. I can there do you that. are. You like it here? Like sleeping on a cloud, it is. Oh, I somehow doubt it, but... Um, okay, I think... Where's my bed? Where do I go to sleep? In the loft. There's a door next to the chicken coop. Inside, there's a ladder up to the loft. You find it all set up for sleeping. Okay. Door next to the chicken coop. All right. Good luck to you. Where, where's the... Oh. Uh, in here? Uh, is it this one here? I can open this and... Oh, okay. And then there's a loft. And then we're going to climb up the ladder. This is actually kind of neat. <laughs> and then does this give me access to all of my stuff? It does! This is what I was looking for. Excellent. Excellent. So my inventory... Now, if I were to go out like this... And now, are we, are we, uh, are we safe here? Oh, and I could sleep here if I wanted to? Okay, I just wanted to know what this place was like, and I think True Groshen's a... Mutt, can you not... Please? Th these are nice people. You don't need to wake them up or annoy them. All right, let's see. Can I move stuff from my horse? If I go to Sidekicks and then Inventory, I can look at... Uh, oh, I have... Oh, a lot of this stuff isn't stolen anymore. Time has... Oh, no. Actually, is, is none of it stolen? Oh, it's all good now. Oh, excellent. Excellent. So time has passed. And I, my understanding is lower value items um, become, un, they lose their stolen status faster. So uh, these are all low items. Low, 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 t the, you know, they're not that exciting. Um, I think what I'll do is I'm going to grab, uh, can I, I can actually grab all of it, but uh, how much is it going to weigh? It's going to weigh a ton, isn't it? My weight is currently 110. Oh, no. Oh, that's the horse. Yeah, I can bring the horse with me. Okay. All right. I don't have to worry about this, but let's take a look then. Oh, man, I, th I should have looked closer. Uh, well, let's see what we've got. We've got some maps and stuff like that. Bianca's ring. You know what? Somebody said I should just put that on and, and be done with it. I'll take a closer look at it. They said, you know, you should at least take a lo closer look at it. Uh, you're right. I probably will. Um, I'm going to keep things like uh, maybe the green shirt and the hunter's gloves no, I'm going to grab those. Leather jerk, and we can sell these items. Maybe we can get some of the stuff repaired. Okay, I am running out of uh, noble shoes. I wouldn't mind actually getting those repaired if I can. Patched hose. And if I can get this repaired, I would be kind of happy. And I think these are fine. They're just dirty. Um, all right, now, and then inventory. Uh, what can I put away? 121. Can I, how well can I move with that? Hunter's gloves. I want to sell some of these items. That's why I'm uh, kind of uh, grabbing them. Or I could put them in the horse. Yeah, I could put them in my horse. Yeah, that'll work. Um, okay, there we go. So this is what I wanted. Access to my little, my chest. No, oh, I can't get, okay. Oh my goodness. That's not what I wanted to do. Sidekick. Uh, and then if I go into my inventory and then we go into, let's say armor, um, let's, let's do a sort by weight and let's, uh, start putting stuff in the, in the horse until my weight drops down. Uh, oh, it's equipped. No, 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 don't do that. And then the jerkin there. Now I'm down in my weight. Okay. We're good. But I wanted to see what was in here. So we've got, um, ancient maps. I do need to do those, by the way. And I do plan on it, but uh, not yet. Uh-oh. Oh! Oh, that hurt. <laughs> All right. Let's, uh, shall we continue? Let's take a look at the rest of uh, Talmberg here. 
Um, is there a grindstone? Your bed. There's a trader, a combat arena. There's a an activity giver over here. Maybe we should go over and take a look. There's a there's the baths. We could go and see if we could have a. Oh, wait a minute. No, no. What is this over here? There's something, an unexplored place over there. I'm now no longer worried about uh, the fact that I have all the stolen items on me. So I'm good there. I'm happy. Okay. Now, let us, first of all, uh, where were the baths? Uh, I want to go get a bath. So, oh, uh, let over the bridge and turn right. Okay. Uh, over the bridge. There we go. I haven't bathed in ages, and I really do need to. Not where the pig is. Okay, turn right, and it should be up here. All right, let's see if we can get ourselves a proper bath. Apparently, they'll fix my clothing as well. So, I'm kind of excited about that. Uh, that looks like somebody of importance over there. Okay, now, let's take a look at ourselves. And make sure that are we what clothes are we wearing and is there any what because I assume we, it only repairs the stuff we're wearing right um, armor so we've got some brown hose and that's but that's not okay patched hose um, let's see let's let's do the sort by that what am I wearing I am wearing hose regular hose where where's my regular hose Tight olive hose. Oh, I like those, though. But they're only worth 18. But the brown hose are worth more. And they don't... These don't need repair. But the patched hose... Oh. This one here. Let's put that on. Okay. And then what else we've got? Noble shoes. I wouldn't mind uh, having my noble shoes. Because right now I'm wearing old boots. So I'm going to wear those. I don't think they're going to repair them. Oops. Oops. Wait a minute. What am I wearing? Boots, hose, legs, gloves. What about my gloves? What's the glove situation? Yeah, they're all about the same. And then I've got this thing here, and then chain mail and body plate. I don't have any of that. All right, I think that's fine. I, I don't know. I'm probably messing up, but that's all right. We're going to do this anyways. Uh, Jesus Christ, your clothes... Were you assaulted? Damn bandits. <laughs> May they burn in hell. <laughs> yes. I would like to use the bathhouse services. I'd like to uh, order something here. And what is it you'd like? Oh, good grief. Um, to have a bath and launder my garments. To heal my wounds. Heal my wounds, bath and laundry. I think I'm good as far as my healing is concerned. Heal my wounds, bath and laundry. Pay for... No, you see, I'm, that's where I'm not going to do anything. Get a haircut, get a shave. Oh, okay. Let's have a, a let's have a bath and launder my garments. Proper bath, and my clothes need washing. But of course, money first, though. Of course, it's not free. Uh, ten groschen. Uh, you know what? Fine. Here it is. I could I'm haggle, sure but you'll I'm be extremely satisfied. Maybe God later. Bless. <laughs> the way she says that. All right, I parted with 10 Grosh, and let's take a look at me. Um, now, they don't repair things like armor, as far as I know. And, yeah, so everything's clean, but they don't repair your garments, I guess, hey? Oh, no, this is what I was wearing as the... Oh, I was still wearing my tight. Oh. Oh, okay. Uh, everything's clean. Oh, well, I guess that's about as good as I can expect. All right, that's fine. Oh, hey, we've got a silver ring. Oh, all right. Thank you. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're good. Okay. <laughs> um, I was supposed to look at uh, Bianca's ring. So let's take a look at this. Uh, it's a ring that I... Oh, I gave this ring to Bianca. Oh, I didn't know that. Oh, so it, it is a keepsake, but it's... Wait a minute. My red thingamabobber is broken. So they can't fix... Uh, oh, I'm not sure about that whole thing. All right, so um, it does charisma and durability. Okay, so it has an impact on my charisma. Is that is that what I'm seeing here? Let's put it on and see what it does. So my charisma is five, 
And item is equipped. Okay. Ring. All right. So it didn't impact my charisma. <laughs> I don't know. I figured I'd put it on and see what it did, and I'm not really sure what it does. Neck chain. Oh, wait a minute. Didn't I? Oh, I, did, I dropped it. No, no, no. I didn't want to drop it. Oh, I transferred it to my horse. That's what I did. Oh, my goodness. I think I transferred it to the horse. Um, yeah, I am really that clueless sometimes. Bianca's ring. I can't believe I did that. X. Okay. And then we go into my... In All right. And we now let's do this property. Go into inventory. Uh, go to Bianca's ring. And it's not X. It's E. Equip. There we go. My charisma is still five. Hang on. Unequip. Equip. It doesn't do anything for me. All right. That's fine. I'm going to wear it, though, just because. Okay. Well, that's cool. Now, let me take a look at something. Um, I know this is kind of uh it's not like a quest episode. This is more things that I need to get done episode. And if I can see baths, is there like a, I want to find out more about uh, repairing stuff. Okay. I'll tell you what, I'm going to look through some stuff and I'm going to pause right now. And uh, we will, uh, once I've taken a look at a few things, I'll, I'll come back. All right, so here we go. Uh, I, I, I did read a few other things, but uh, this is the core of it. Um, it's best to have your equipment repaired by experts. A, smor a swordsmith will grind nicks out of your sword edge. A plate armor will beat the dents out of, the cura out of your cuirass. And even a regular blacksmith can handle light repairs. You can take your ripped clothing to a tailor, scuffed boots to a cobbler, while the wenches at any bathhouse will wash the dirt and dried blood out of your clothes. So they can only clean. That's okay. That's good. I, uh, this is the sort of thing I wanted to know. So I think what I'll do is I'm going to, uh, well, let's see. I'm, I'm going to put on my better armor. Uh, if I have any, actually, I think that that is the best <laughs> stuff that I have right now. <laughs> um, I'm going to put on the mail collar. Oh, that one actually is there. Oh, I'm already equipping it. Okay. Uh, yeah, I guess I don't really have much choice. Padded shows. Bam braces. I could just sell some of this stuff. Do I have any uh, any sort of uh, armor that is not broken, like the padded armor? No, I don't. Uh, my working boots are still in better shape. I might just uh, wear those. So I'm going to grab those, move them to inventory, go to inventory, uh, go down to my boots, uh, and put these working boots back on because yeah no 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 that's not what i wanted to do i moved it to the horse again oh my god <laughs> seriously seriously oh 39 oh i have more than one set of oh, i have hunting boots Ew. Ew. i think i'll just put those on uh, man, I gotta get used to this interface. This is, um, quite painful for... I'm sure it's painful for you as well. There we go. Equip those. Okay. All right, well, let's go and see what else, uh, the bustling burg of Tam Talmberg has to offer. Um, we've, we're at least presentable and clean now. We've gone to a bathhouse and, uh, we've gotten ourselves all tidied up. So, let's see. There was one place, if we take a look on the map, that we didn't uh, go take a look at and it was over here all right so we're currently at we have lodgings over here we're currently here so we want to go over the river no down here and then over the river so wait a minute is it this way yeah and then we want to go over the river and then follow the path out to here. Okay. All right, let's go. There's got to be a grindstone around here somewhere. I think we want to go up this way. Is this right? This doesn't seem right. Oh, it is right. Okay. Let's keep going then. Do, 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 do. What is up here? Oh, it's a. Is this a. 
Oh, it's a huntsman. Oh, I could sell... Um, oh, can I sell whatchamacallit here? Oh, let's take a look and see what he's got to do. He's a tanner. Huntsman Nicholas. Let's talk to him. God be with you. All right. Uh, training. <gasps> Hunting bow hound master. Bow. Can you teach me to be a better archer? Certainly. How much is this going to cost me? Uh, beginner. I'd like to practice the basics. All right, but it'll cost you. Uh, 60 Groschen. Uh, maybe another time. Maybe another time. Okay. And let's take let's take a look at trade. I, I just want to know how much it was going to cost me to do stuff like that. Now, he sells proper bows and better air. Oh, he's got arrows. Oh. Now, what I could do... <laughs> the joy of gutting. <laughs> okay, that just sounds wrong. <laughs> the joy of gutting. I guess that improves... You read that and it improves some of your... Your stats. Wolf's fangs. All right. Let me see what I can sell. I have a uh, boar hide. Uh, I could sell that. Um, what else we got here? Uh, I could probably sell some hunter's gloves. Now, I'm wearing one pair of gloves. Uh, oh, these are not the... Oh. You know what? Uh, can I add to them? add them to the basket even if I'm wearing them? Because I want to sell the... The ones that are in the worst shape, and I want to keep the ones that are in the best shape. So if I go E, item is equipped. To proceed, it will be unequipped. Yes. And then I want to uh, sell these ones. And then uh, I'm wearing the hunting boots. So I'm going to keep them because I think they're probably pretty snazzy. And what else we got that we could sell this dude? Uh, I could probably sell him just about anything. Got a villager's ash bow. I've got a wounding arrow. Piercing arrow and hunting arrow and then the better hunting arrow okay and then uh so let's go to buy and then let's see what's in the basket right now so oh here we go your wealth is 486 trader's wealth is 200 reputation is for for uh, 53 which i think is just over neutral and trading items for uh oh you get okay i'm i'm selling for 55 so i'm gonna get 55 for that and then if i want to buy things do i want to buy a better bow i think i at the very least i want better arrows right if i what's my current bow it is a villager's bow right the the villager's ash bow which is uh in uh not oh it's in perfect shape okay 13.4 though okay and then if I wanted to buy a bow, how much does he sell villagers ash bow? 78. So it really is the lowest of the low when it comes to bows. Oh, a, a yew bow. Now, yew is, is a great wood for making bows out of, from what I understand. A hazel hunting bow is expensive. An ash hunting bow. Um, what's the difference between them? So I currently have the ash bow. If I go to Q... Ordinary bow made from uh, by someone handy. Okay. Um, agility. And then we've got... It's a, okay. Uh, minimum strength and agility is 2, 1. Power is 37. Okay. Now, what about this U bow? Minimum strength is 6. Oh, wow. This is like... I would... I barely meet the requirements for this thing. Yeah. Okay. Hmm. And if I ash bow, it does 50 damage right there. You see that? And that's with my current arrows that I have equipped, I'm assuming. These guys here, which are the, uh, yeah. Oh, do I have any arrows equipped at all? I don't know, I don't know if I do. Uh, hazel bow is slightly worse, and it does 44. Okay. And then 46 is the villager's elm bow. Okay, so Elm's not bad. Dogwood is worse. 5, 4, 4, 3, 6, 4. Uh, and then a Hazel Hunting Bow I cannot use, and an Ash Hunting Bow I cannot use. All right. Well, that's kind of interesting. Um, I'm not sure I want to uh, do... I, I just wanted to investigate like what it is that's available. My bow is crappy, but... Um, 
it's not, oh, it is pretty bad. 114, that's the hazel bow. It gives me 44 versus 39. You know what? I'm going to, I'm going to get one. I'm going to grab, I'm going to buy a new bow. And then I want some arrows. So quality arrows, uh, they're 6.6, 5.5. And they do 56, 54, 36. Better long distance arrow, better hunting arrow. I believe that's what I have right now. And they're not too expensive. And they do... Uh... Oh, wait a minute. I can sell my, I can sell, uh, my bow. Uh, weapons. Yeah, I can sell my bow. So I'm going to add that to the uh, thing and accept, right? In fact, yeah, and buy, let's see, um, I could just buy the better hunting arrow. I think that's probably, uh, it's probably, you know, it's, it's a long distance arrow. I'm going to just get a few so that I, ha I can, I, I hope to be able to find them, but I just need some because I, if I get into trouble, I wouldn't mind being able to, I'm just going to grab 10 just so that I can defend myself if I have to. There we go. And uh, go to the basket, and I think we'll close the deal. In this case, though, I think I'm going to haggle. Can we do something about the price? I... Why not? Why not? Indeed, good sir! Uh, let's try dropping down to 45. Are we agreed? Well, now, a little more and we'll shake on it. All right. How about uh, 50? All right, so. <laughs> there we go. A little bit of haggling. All right, so that was kind of interesting. I haven't really done too much, but that's the kind of thing that I was hoping that I would be able to do when I came here. And I still wouldn't mind finding a... Well, we don't know what this activity giver is. Interesting. Is there anything that looks like it might have a grindstone? All right, I think what I'm going to do, I, you know, I bet you th there's probably a grindstone up in, uh, in the, in the thing. So let's, uh, let's, let's just, uh, we'll, we'll, we'll maybe cruise around a little more in Talmberg, in the town. I don't think there's much else though. Can I go down here? I can. Oh, it's a real switchback, though. Look at this. It's a lovely little town. I do quite like this. It's got a little creek running through it. I bet you... Yes, oh, that's right. It said fishing area. So there's fishing in here. Oh, no, no. That's not a place I can go over. Okay. Wait a minute. Uh... <laughs> I got I got turned around. Oh, I have to go straight. Okay. I'm just riding my horse right through the inn here. Okay. And then I don't think there's anything else here that's I've got the bathhouse. Okay, I'm I'm just gonna head up into the, the castle then. Do 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 and then uh, see if we can find ourselves a, uh, a grindstone. There's got to be a grindstone somewhere in Talmberg. Hang on. Is there... How do I get up there? Is it, there's a turning... Oh, here it is, up here. I mean, I could go back to Scalitz, but that's... Uh, yeah, that's probably not the best idea. All right. And I come... Don't want to run anybody over. Now, this is the... There's a trader. We've got this, this little area here. There's got to be a... Uh... All right, I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to go in here. I'm going to drop off my horse in the main little courtyard area. And I'm going to just... I'm going to poke around a bit. So, yeah, uh, I'll be back. All right, so I, I, I 
cruised around the castle. I cannot find a blacksmithy, grindstoney thing anywhere. So we're just going to, we got the trader that's in this, the castle. We're going to, I'm going to sell a bunch of other stuff I went through. And these are sort of the things that I can get rid of. So, oh, wait a minute. Can I take a look at the, uh, what is the info on this thing? Uh, Charisma 14, condition 100%. It doesn't seem to do anything. An accessory for townsmen or townswomen and merchants' wives. Okay. <laughs> you know, I might not. You know what? I'm going to remove that because I think I, I want to give something to, to uh, Teresa. I don't, want to give, uh, I don't want to give her Bianca's ring. So I think I'm going to just, yeah, we're going to not sell that. I'm going to actually keep that as a potential gift for Teresa. I know I could have gone to like the jewelry shop and bought something for her new... And I probably stole it from somebody, but I'm not worried about that. <laughs> Close the deal. And then, um, oh, it doesn't have enough money. Oh, how much money? They, oh, they only have 79. Ooh, okay, so what can we not sell? How about, um, how about the, uh, Let's just not sell this. It's efficient. It, it, yeah, uh, it's efficient to carry it. So I will remove that, and then we can sell everything else. All right, close the deal. Okay. Oh, I meant to haggle. Oh, well, never mind. All right, so I think what we're going to do, let's take a look and see what's in the immediate area. Maybe there's something interesting. Um, the one guy from the tavern said something about a. there's a quarry. Um, I do wonder about that. So I, uh, maybe we'll check out the quarry. I suspect... That the reason why it was even mentioned at all is there's probably going to be something to do with the quarry in in, a, in the game. But uh, where would the quarry be? Oh 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 oh! Right up here. Look at that. There's a quarry. It's it's up this way. <gasps> blacksmith. There's a blacksmith at the quarry. Okay. All right. So we want to go uh, out the. Uh, I can't. Okay. I'll tell you what. Let's just get out on the road and then figure out where, where to go from yeah. here. All right. Cool. <laughs> yeah, I'm actually kind of enjoying doing a little bit of my own little uh, sort of exploration and stuff like that. As as um, as silly as it may be, I'm not the most uh, effective haggler or all, anything like that. And I still am trying to get used to this interface. All right, so we are here. Do I want to turn right or left? Uh... I think I actually want to go down through here. Oh. I want to go th down. I want to turn right. Yeah, I think I want to go this way. I think this is right. It's a bit hard to tell from the map, but that's okay. Yeah. Oh, oh. Okay, I was going to gallop, but I don't want to run over anybody. <laughs> I have a reputation to maintain. <laughs> These people were very nice to me, and they, they helped me out, and they patched me up and when I was in a rough spot. And so I'm thinking, you know, I don't want to make anybody mad. I think I want to go this way because it's we want to go out of town. So there we go. Kick it in the high gear. <laughs> That's it. Uh, onward, pebbles. <laughs> Doo, doo, doo. Now, I think this is actually the way we came from Scallons. Oh, look, there's the quarry. Oh, I remember the quarry we ran through here when we were being chased by Cumans. Oh, okay. All right, so is that the blacksmith way over there? Let's take a quick look and see. Uh, I can't zoom in any further. Okay, I think it is. He's up ahead, so that looks like... Yep, he's got a bellows. Okay, okay. Maybe we can uh, we can get something done. Now, what is my money situation right now? Uh, 491. Okay. Now, let's see. Ah, there's a grindstone. Oh, I would have discovered this because I would have passed through here at one point. That's right. Okay, now. All right, so um, I need to learn how to use the grindstone, so we're going to take a look in the codex, and I think I did see under equipment maintenance. I remember reading this when I was uh, off doing my studying. So um, here it is, the grindstone. To hone a weapon, uh, go to the grinding wheel, start the process E. Select which weapon you want to hone. The weapon must be honed along the whole length of the blade, so use 
I guess, mouse left and right to move the blade. And the blade must be held at the correct angle to uh, for the grinding wheel. Too shallow and the edge won't be sharpened. Too steep and it will dull the blade even more. To control the angle... Okay, left and right to go left and right and then forward and backward to uh, change the angle. Uh, you must exert the correct pressure to hone the edge. Oh my goodness, this depletes stamina <laughs> using right mouse and uh, to... Okay, use right mouse and release with... Oh, okay. Push down right mouse and release with uh, letting go. And then meanwhile, you have to keep the stone running by hitting space. I am not going to remember this. I have to try it. Uh, sparks, uh, Flying sparks tell you you're honing property. Black smoke tells you you're damaging the blade. A well-honed blade is smooth and shiny. When uh, There you go. All right. So, okay. I think I... Uh, we're going to do the, um, the mercenaries, uh, the burger's sword. Is it apparent? Yeah, it. Yeah, I'm gonna do both of them, but let's do this one for now. Okay, so there's the there's the 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 okay, and then. Uh. Am I doing this right? I'm not, I don't, oh, it's the mouse. Oh, no, no, it's, I get it now. It's, oh, sparks. Oh, 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 okay, move forward. Oh, I think I got that right, okay. And, oh, no, maybe not, but let's try this again. Oh, does it do both sides at once? Okay, sparks. <laughs> it it seems to reset itself every once in a while. But look at that. oh, I think I've almost got it. Look at that. Oh, I my stamina. Okay. Oh, hey, you know what? This blade is starting to look not bad. It's not looking bad. Okay, stamina's back. There we go. Now, I was told that there is a way to... Uh, you can sort of, like, use this system to kind of improve your skill by damaging and then repairing the blade repeatedly. Okay. I think we got a little bit more to go on this one here. The sparks are apparently good. <laughs> I don't know. Okay, escape. Let's see what we got here. What did we do? What did we do with that blade? You, I've reached a new level in maintenance. <laughs> um, that was the weapons. That was the burger sword. Uh, 97. Oh, you know what? I'm going to take it. I. Well, let's see if we can get to 100. Okay, let's do that again. No, oh, no, no. Uh, other uh, no not <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let's try that again. Ninety-seven. That's pretty cool. Okay, we didn't do too badly. All right. So no, no. I damaged it a bit. You can even see it, kind of. Oh, right there. There's a bit of wonkiness. Get some stamina back. Okay, let's go again. I think I'm actually doing more damage to it than I am repairing it. Okay, I think that's... Did I, did I make it worse? I probably made it worse. Burger sword. Yeah, I think I made it worse, didn't I? <laughs> I did. <laughs> oh my goodness. 
All right, I'll tell you what. I'm going to I'm going to finish off uh I'm going to do a little more of this um and then I'll get back to you when I can actually do it right. <laughs> Cuz this is uh I, there's only so long I'm going to subject you to making me watch uh or m- making you watch. You know what I mean. <laughs> All right. Look at that. I got each one of them to 99. I am not going to try to go any further with that. I th- I think it increased the value of the burger sword. That is pretty cool. Oh, by the way, I did forget to check the price that I saw the, sold the boar hide for, so I don't remember. But it's it's in the footage; <laughs> it'll be there. Um, but yeah, I, I yeah, I meant to. I was thinking about that. All right, so we have now um, we've got our our sword and all of that sort of our two swords. Well, I've got one that I'm mercenaries. Oh, wait a minute, which one? Should, should, uh, this one's not worth as much, but it doesn't do as much damage. What is going on? Burger's sword. 43, 45. It, it weighs less, does less damage, and costs more. I can just sell this sword. I think the, uh, the mercenary's bedfellow is a better sword by the looks of it. Even though it's cheaper. Interesting. I don't know if I'll do that yet, but uh, all right, let's talk to the uh, talk to the blacksmith. Hey, he's dressed like dad. <laughs> Good health to you. Oh well, you too. Thank you. Um, about repairs. Good luck to you. Uh, yeah, let's see if we can get these repaired. Uh, oh, how much? Fifty-five. <gasps> oh, it's not cheap. It's not cheap. Okay, so he he can repair. Oh, the glove. What else is? Yeah, I need to repair those and maybe the gloves. Wow, it's not cheap. Uh, maybe the shield. That wasn't too bad. Mail collar, seventy-nine to eighty-one. Okay, this is starting because of the it's the amount of damage. Okay, so I think we're we're doing pretty good. And then uh, I could get him to finish off these, but yeah. So this one is going to cost a lot because of how much damage it has. But I'm going to, I'm going to, I want to learn how to repair these things myself. And I think I can um, do that. In fact, before we do anything, let's, well, let's, let's haggle. Let's just do this. Let's do this. Uh, oh, wait a minute. What, there's no, another, okay. Um, let's have a word about the price. Mm, all right, so. <laughs> um, he didn't seem too happy about this whole situation. <laughs> I'm just gonna make. I'm just gonna offer eighty. All right, so. There. <laughs> it, all right, so it, <laughs> we got a little bit off the price. Let's take. Let's let's take. Let's talk to him and see what he has about. Take care now. What can he? What can I buy from him? Um, so we've got, we can get an axe, bludgeon. I think that's what that one guy that I didn't loot had. So yeah, it's not worth much, is it? Uh, charcoal, bassinet. I don't need any of this stuff. Oh, he's got a dagger. I want to have a dagger just because I think, uh, I think you need a dagger for some things. So I'm going to grab the dagger. Uh, let's see. Uh, yeah, I'm going I'm to buy that. What's my money at? 411? You know, we're not doing too bad. Uh, horseshoes, kettle hat, uh, noble horseshoes. Oh. A horse is made for farm horse. Uh, part, part, okay, they don't do anything else. Oh, no, no, escape. I don't want to do anything. I don't want to, no. I don't need them. Uh, I think I'm going to check and see if what Pebbles has before I do anything like that. Uh, robber's sword. Oh, a sh- shard. Okay. Wow, my sword's actually not that bad. Like my sword, where is it? Uh, it it's the uh, the other one, weapons. Uh, the burger sword. No, the mercenary's bedfellow is forty six forty six two. Yeah, forty six forty six two. But his this shard is thirty six forty four. Wow, my sword's better. Okay. I'm going to keep that. Ah, this is what I wanted. A small armorer's kit. Yes. I want to buy... I'm just going to buy one for now. And then a blacksmith's kit. I'm going to buy one of those for now. Because I want to try doing repairs on my own stuff. Travel horseshoes. I need to look into that. Kettle hat. 
I think that's good. I don't really think I need anything else for now. I'm just going to go with that. So, um, can I sell anything? I Should I sell the burger sword? I mean, it's... Is there anything special about it? Short sword. Less weapon than a status symbol. It will, uh, it will do for defense in a pinch, but it's not recommended for the battlefield. All right. So, it's more status. Okay. Nope. Um, I think what we'll do is we're going to sell it. Let's... Let's get rid of it. We've got our mercenary's bedfellow. And I'm going to keep uh, pretty well everything else. Okay. I think that's good. And then, um, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think we're good. Uh, close the deal. And actually, I'm going to do something here. Um, I'm going to try something. I'm going to haggle. Let's talk about the price. Hmm... All right, so. <laughs> All right, so. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to pay five more, and that, I'm, that's going to make him like me. And I just want, I'm just doing this for as an exercise. It's only five groschen. Here you are with a little top-up. Well, now, thank you very See? much. Now, in the future, maybe I'll get, like, better deals from him. You know, I'll have, like, a good reputation with this guy. All right, so there we go. That's a little bit of... I, I. This is some of the stuff that I wanted to get taken care of. Um, I could do with some food. I'll probably... Uh, well, what time is it? Uh, it is noon. Um, what I could... Actually, you know what we could do? I think what I'm going to do is I'm just going to maybe uh, grab a few things from the horse and sell them. And, uh, yeah. Oh, the sea axe, Nicop N Nicopolis saber... Brown felt hat, brown hose. How much money did that guy have? I don't know. Padded, yeah. Got hair meat. Oh, man. Uh, I'm going to drop this because it's no good. And, right. Knight's hunting sword. I mean, I could, I could do some repairs and stuff like that. So, but I think... This is this is a bit of a taste. So I think that we're good. This is I'm going to stop here. Um, we've done some repairs. I did a little bit of uh, cruising around in in Talmberg. I got familiar with the town. We got a place to stay. Uh, I'm going to just do some more background stuff. I'm going to maybe filter through my the horse's inventory. Maybe sell a few other things. And it's really not that exciting. But I just I wanted to show a little bit of my day going through Talmberg and sorting some stuff out. Uh, in the next one, I think what, what we're going to do is if we take a look at the journal. Um, I do want to continue with this. I'm going to go to Ushitz. And one of the things that I'm going to do is I'm going to actually... Uh, where is it? Uh, side quests. Courtship. Main vengeance. Mighty of the Sword. That's it. I don't know why I didn't see it before. Uh, maybe it's time I learned to read. So I'm going to visit a scribe in Ushitz while I'm there. And also we're going to do find the dude with the limp. So we're going to do... A little bit of both. We're going to do a bit of the main quest. We're going to do some side quests and uh, get that stuff done. And I also wouldn't mind eventually going back and talking to Teresa. And I've got a nice silver ring for her. I think she'll love that. So, yeah. Thank you very much, everyone. Until next time, where we uh, we go to Ushitz. <laughs> you all have yourselves a great day. Bye-bye.